Hey everybody, welcome back to Pixel Junkies. Welcome back. We're playing Freedom Fighters on PC. And we're gonna get this building, whatever it is. I gotta get it right up there. The rice paper building. Oh, there's a dude up there. The what? There's a dude up there. Is that the guy you gotta kill? Uh, it's a guy I can kill. Oh. Uh, scroll wheel on the thing. I'm out of ammo. Shit. God damn it. We'll throw it at him. That there works. What was that noise? What are all these bullets passing <laughs> past my face? Why is this dead guy in blood everywhere? Did you hear those bullets? Uh, what? Did you hear those bullets? <laughs> Did you hear those? Ah. <laughs> don't interrupt I me. don't know why. <laughs> don't interrupt me. You did. Go kill those. Where are you going? <laughs> he jumps out <laughs> the window. <laughs> <laughs> nice aiming, dudes. These guys, man. How can they not see you? Oh, they can see me. They choose not to uh, do anything can't about it. Can't be bothered about it. I can't do this. Fuck that. It's only the Americans. <laughs> There's only a bunch of Americans killing all of my friends. Except I'm Russian, so I don't have any friends. Not that I can't have friends, but I'm Russian, therefore I don't believe in them. I don't. I actually don't believe in Americans. <laughs> don't believe in Americans. <laughs> don't believe in Americans. Yay! Something lyrics. It actually Watch works and stuff. So that's cool. Enemies killed 39. They killed 36, you killed 39. Yep. Which is kind of hilarious considering there's a bunch of those guys and only one of you. They also use more med kits. And they fired more shots. Yeah, they suck, basically. Yeah. It'd be funny if they took more time on the level than you. <laughs> and they took that eight and a half minutes. Which is less time. So we it. finished those group of missions. Not one profession. And now we get another group of missions. Good evening. I think, group all missions. I think after every group of missions, it like, moves forward in time a few months. Oh, so it skips heads? Yeah. yeah. There's a... Uh, you can see a line. I'm pointing to it, which you can't see, but next to the hammer and sickle thing, there's a line. I don't think that's to be supposed to be there. I hope it is, Aaron. Why? I hope it's supposed to be there. Otherwise, like, this is a bad <laughs> No. This is a bad new monitor. I'm sure it's in the video, too. <laughs> They're not dead pixels. I'm just saying that it's like the texture they imported for that logo. Oh. There's like a black line on the side of it. Well, keep an eye there. <laughs> if you're not seeing anything, Andrew's <laughs> monitor is a piece of shit. Uh, <laughs> but I think it's probably a little until we can I would have noticed it before it was. Mm. I hate that guy. His head is way too small. Oh. I think his body is way too big. Oh, whatever. Yeah, you can throw Phil Coulson there in the background or whatever. Jude Law. I think it's Jude Coulson. Jude Coulson. Jude. Like, if, you're, if your head is the size of your friggin' forearm, like, you know, <laughs> chill out a bit. Yeah, they're just talking about, uh, there's no situation here. The freedom fighter, as he's being called. Don't worry about him. That was an improper grammar, I think. See? I'm, I'm, the time is moving forward. Yeah, My hair is longer. Enlarged coat. There's a typo on that uh, ticker on the bottom of the screen last time. Was there? Yeah, it said, it's fall in New York or something, but it said, it apostrophe oh. ass. It is Well, they are fall. Russian. <laughs> They need to slow down a bit. Oh. And spell it correctly. Get it? Yeah, yeah. the line isn't there. So it was the right, logo. We're good. I can stock up on uh, munitions Random here boxes. now. We've got we've got guns and stuff in the base. Cool. That I can take with me. Oh, you got a jacket with a hood, with a massive seam down the middle. Yeah. They keep on hiding the. the what does it change it here? Back. <clears throat> His hair is growing longer. I bet he's not getting a haircut. It's a different style now. He's just parting it on the side, in the middle. Parting it on the side, on the side uh, in the middle. Yeah. Parting it. Completely in the different. There we go. 
That's impossible for that concrete to have that texture. Just saying. Sometimes I wonder how Mr. Jones gets all his information. And Mr. Jones is the old. So guy. why the frig is she still wearing a friggin' tank top and you're wearing like a? She doesn't do Nelly anything. Hansen she lives down suit. here in the sewers where. It's, yeah, where it's freezing. Yeah. If it's cold on the surface, it's freezing it's just down here. One too. giant like hole there. Anyway. Proceed. Proceed with uh, objectives. Power station. Destroying the power lines will kill the floodlights in the docking area. Small ass text. What else? Movie theater. So I got a helipad and a, mo and a movie theater. The helipad is probably where I want the to. The helipad. Helipad. Do I have C4? Man, already. Viewers are getting bored. Yes, I have C4. I, I'm getting bored. Oh. <laughs> Hurry up. All right. Take some. I'll go here. All right. So, gotta go. Why is he wearing a jacket? It's not even cold. Sure it is. It's like raining out. It's raining. That doesn't mean you need to wear a winter jacket. I would wear a winter jacket in the rain. If I had a winter yeah, jacket. Yeah, if it was freezing out. Yeah. But there probably would be ice too. And it wouldn't be raining. It'd be snowing. Oh, you're gonna die. Yay! Just started the level though, so whatever. It don't matter. Yeah, I know. I was just uh, feeling the uh, feeling there's, what it was like. Here. You know, there's people that uh, you guys go don't know them. that that snow is made out of ice. What? Or like, I don't know. I was watching a thing one time, and it snowed, and I'm not gonna say it just snowed in a location where it doesn't usually snow. And one of the people said, "I didn't realize snow was so cold." I was <laughs> like, you know, it's it's made out of frozen water. <laughs> like, what do you expect? That's really dumb. It is really dumb. Like, uh, I, I wanted to snow so I could be warm. How do they, like, exist? How do they live their lives without knowing snow is cold? I don't know. It, it was, uh... This person was in their, like, 40s or 50s, too. So it's like... No you, excuse. You got no excuse. Zero excuse. Yep. Um, I forgot what I was going to say. Oh, yeah. Are, so, is, like, water the only thing that freezes at, like... Like, I know other stuff freezes. Like, say, gas will freeze at a, at a temperature that's different than water. Mm -hmm. But, um... Is there, like, a, an element or something that freezes well above water's freezing point? Say, like, 20 degrees Fahrenheit. Mercury. Mercury doesn't freeze. Well, it freezes, but well, it becomes a solid, but it doesn't freeze well above cell, uh, uh, zero Celsius, which is like you know, uh, you know, zero Celsius is freezing in Fahrenheit, which is uh, thirty-two or something. Yes. So, for a, a twenty degrees would be about like seventy or eighty. I don't know. I don't know Fahrenheit very well, so that's my guess. But for our American viewers, which are probably most of them. It's around that temperature, so I don't know if there's anything that freezes at, like, that temperature and gets, you know, hotter. Although, I guess you could argue that wa that metal is technically frozen, and then at, like, 2,000 degrees, it becomes a liquid. So, being cold frozen is not a requirement of being frozen? Well, it's something that, I guess, not necessarily, like, you know, frozen, because I guess frozen entails that it's... You know, made out of water and it became ice. But frozen in the sense that it became solid. Hmm. So, I, I don't know. I guess I answered the question ladies. a little bit. Ladies. Yeah. And two of them. Well, I can actually, get four people There's now. twins. Two twins. Yeah. Actually, there's triplets. The chick in the, in the brown. Actually, they're all in brown vests. But then blue shirt. Three That's of them. their uniform. The brown vest. Yeah. The uh, non-protective sleeveless vest, where only men are allowed to wear coats. People. I'll <laughs> save you oh. twins for later. <laughs> That's racist. What? You get three like you know has Hispanic women following you, and you're saving the blondes for later. Blonde Caucasians. Yeah. 
I'm a little racist about it. It is. Maybe I'm saying that... You're saving your worst for last? Yeah. Oh, okay. It's still racist. I know it is. <laughs> Why'd you move in front of me? But we're white, so it's okay. I'm not. <laughs> You're not white. Andrew's an anomaly. Doesn't have a name. I'm an anonymous. <laughs> he's, he's an albino. Yeah. <laughs> Isn't it like, uh, albinos, some albinos are born without the UV filters on their eyes? Or did I just make that up? I don't know, man. Because there are people born without UV filters, right? Mm-hmm. And you can get them removed so you can see an ultraviolet light. Or you can see ultraviolet colors, I guess. Or, I guess light, because I don't even, I don't know what... Why would you do color. that? Like, voluntarily do that? Like, hey, I'm going to get that removed. So, so you can see ultraviolet light, why not? Yeah, but you screw up your vision permanently. No, you don't. Well, that... Well, you change it permanently. You'll never be able to go back. Well, you won't see what you see now, no. No. But, uh... Do you know why it's interesting evolutionary trait as to why humans have UV filters and most animals don't? Do you know why? No. Nope. Fun fact. Um, humans have UV filters on their eyes because... The lifespan of most animals isn't long enough for the effects of ultraviolet light to actually affect their eyes. Wow. So if you can see ultraviolet light for, uh, you know, say 20 years, eventually you'll go blind because the light does so much damage to your eye. So because animals don't live long enough, they don't have the filter because they die anyway. But because humans live to be like 80 or whatever, then we would go blind by our 30s. If we could see an ultraviolet light. So, if a person chooses to get the filter off... Yeah. Like, when they're young, they'll go blind by the time they're 30? Yeah, they'll either go blind or have very... They'll have a really hard time seeing at all. Like, they'll be, you know, legally Sign blind. me up. <laughs> yeah. I think it'd be interesting to see it. Like, I'd probably do it when I was 85. Get my filters taken off. And be like, yeah, that's pretty cool. And then what if die. you didn't like it? Like, shit. <laughs> well, I probably won't be able to see it in 85 anyway. So it won't make a difference. <laughs> Why the hell is everything, like, dark and shit? What's up with that? Like, there, there's, um... There are, like, illustrations as to what ultraviolet light looks like, but it can't... I don't think it can look like that, can it? I don't know. Because if it can look like that, then that means we can already see it. Which kind of defeats the purpose of ultraviolet light. So it must look different than what we can see. Yeah. So it'd be... It's sort of interesting concept to, like try and consider like you know we can only see you know like uh so, we don't we can only really see six colors yeah that's it but we can't see the spectrum beyond those combinations of six colors even though there's like 700 billion of them but still i mean all the same it, seeing in like ultraviolet light or infrared light or whatever the other spectrums are x-ray gamma why didn't these guys do anything I don't know. Oh, this thing. Be able to see in radio waves. Yeah. Why is there a manhole in a friggin' underground parking uh, garage? I don't know. Maybe this was built after they designed the sewer system. After? Yeah. Oh. Like the parking garage was built I was saying after. You said the manhole was built after. But... No, no, the parking garage was built <clears throat> on top of the manhole. Then it would make sense. How? Do, why do all the manholes? go down into the like central sewer system it's new york do they do, do they actually do that i don't know man <laughs> no idea because i know there's like manholes here that if you lift them off they go down like six feet and they're just gravel yeah and there's nothing there there's like yeah, we were gonna build a manhole here but then we just said fuck that and just put a cover over it yeah, those are just fake manholes well they're drainage is what they are they're not like sewer they're just like and they're not really manholes either. They're like those the square grates with the holes in them. So mm -hmm. they're for excess water. So they just goes just goes into the water table and dissipates. But it's still a bit of a troll. It's like, oh shit, I dropped my keys down this manhole. I gotta go all the way down to the rebel base and get them. Why didn't they move at the <laughs> very last second? That looked like the guy from Gone in sixty seconds. The um, the Russian. Yeah, guy. the Russian guy. <laughs> The tall dude with the sandwich and the coat. Oh. And he's like, Nicholas Cage. Much 
<laughs> Nichols Cage. Nichols Cage. Your name is Memphis for some reason. The name should have been Nichols. Nichols. Mercury Nichols. Memphis is such a. Memphis. <laughs> the name is. The they just song. looked at a map of America and were like, <laughs> "That sounds cool. Oh, that's a cool name." We're gonna call it Chicago, but we went with Memphis. Where is Memphis? Uh, Illinois. Memphis, Illinois. Nope, maybe not. Mm -hmm. I have no idea where Memphis is. It's either, I think it's in uh, Detroit or Arizona or something. I don't know. Call me ignorant. <clears throat> well, Detroit is a city. So it's not going to be in Detroit. Oh yeah, I'm in Michigan. But it's in Tennessee. Memphis, Tennessee, so. of course. Yes, of course. No, I know now, obviously, because you told me. But it sounds right. It's 11 degrees in, in Memphis right now. That dates the video. <laughs> <laughs> when was it last 11 degrees? Jesus Christ, you recorded it that long ago. <laughs> Why are all these guys dead? I'm not going to heal all of you. They're like laying on, they're planking. <laughs> oh. Not anymore, they're not. I was going to eat earlier, and then I didn't, because we were going to go out for supper. But now I'm fucking starving. Well, you'll have a nice big meal now. I will. I don't even know where we're going. Jordan's probably going to want fucking salad or some shit. <laughs> salad. <laughs> I'm kind of actually, and as much as this contradicts my usual, uh, my usual facade of dickness, I'm actually kind of feeling winging it. Really? Yeah. Nobody knows what that is. Well, I'm pretty sure it's they put the two It's a wing place. It, really? They sell <laughs> cheeseburgers. They don't have wings. But it's that. like it's like Baskin Rock. It's like Jelly Bellies, but with chicken wings, basically. The question is, will Jordan be up for that? I don't know. Why not? I don't know. And get some sack flavored wings. Maybe straight to his balls or something. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. This is going to run on for months. It's going to be hilarious. <laughs> next time you hear Jordan, well, I'm not going to say next time. His voice is going to be different because of his balls. <laughs> Wouldn't it be hilarious if we made, because we haven't, none we of haven't us have actually talked to him. So we haven't actually talked like, to him since he had his. Hi, <laughs> guys. Hey, guys. My balls are feeling. <laughs> oh, that's good. We're going to go now. <laughs> Want to see my scar? Com no, that's gross. <laughs> Super poker face. Yeah. I wonder if, it, if they had to, like, do a Brazilian right down the middle so they could, you know. Hey, it's a movie theater. <laughs> I'm just picturing, like, a... like a. I can shoot through the uh, thing here. Like, if you... I don't know. I can't even think of something. But something really glossy. You know, like, dip it in, like, in a... Dip it in shellac. It's permanently gloss. <laughs> Never goes hair again. And we're on the topic of Jordan's sack again. This yeah. episode must be coming to a close. <laughs> and it is. This episode should be called Jordan's Sack. Jordan's Balls. Yeah. <laughs> We've probably called the last 15 episodes of Jordan's Balls. You should... The, all the Freedom Fighter episodes that come out... <laughs> Should be slight variations <laughs> on Jordan's nutsack. <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> He's gonna hate us. Whatever. Well, considering, he hates us. Considering he wanted to do this series on PC and he's not even here. <laughs> Maybe even more of a fuck you. Random plant in the middle of the room. Yeah, man, it's all postmodern or modern. I don't know. I don't know what the difference is. I mean, even postmodern. It wasn't even modern when it came out. It's postmodern, even though it's pre-modern. I'm not good at design stuff. Like a lot of people aren't. Yeah. Let's say I have. Let's say I have. So we're gonna uh, erect this flag here. I <laughs> erect Jordan's balls. Um, <laughs> <laughs> And then we're gonna put an uh -huh. end to this episode. 
that it? Is that all you gotta do? Yep. Alright. We're done this area. Yep. Good job, guys. Good job we for watching. This. Good job, everybody. Tune in next week and we'll I continue. killed way more guys than you guys did. Yeah, and fired 400 less rounds. We'll be back next week with a brand new episode of this. Hopefully the game doesn't take shit. Hopefully not. See you next time. Bye.